Hey guys, it's Nick from Idle Insight here. Um, today I'll be showing you how to embed your virtual tour into your Facebook page. Um, we've helped hundreds of clients uh, place their virtual tour onto their Facebook page and it's a really useful way to drive social engagement. Um, so what I'll do first is I'll show you how a tour looks on a Facebook page. So I'll just go to um, our Facebook page just here. And as you can see, you'll have this tab here, which says see inside the Olympic Park. Um, and just below it, we've got the London Aquatic Centre. So it's Google Street View technology again. So you've got your virtual tour. You can navigate your way around. And if I move forward, you'll see we've got Tom Daly on tour, which ties in with the Olympics. Um, so what I'll do is I'll show you how to put your virtual tour onto your Facebook page. And let's get started. So what you'll need to do first is you need to access this page here. And to do so, I've placed a link in the comments box just below the video. So if you just click on that link and it will direct you to this page here. Next, uh, you need to just click on the green tab there, install page tab. And what you need to do then is click this drop down and you'll see your business name drop down in the, the icon there. So if I click Idle Insight and I can click Add page tab there. So once that loads up your Facebook page, you have another green button, which will be the configure page tab. So if you click on that, and what it will do is then install the tab into your Facebook page to give you the ability to embed the tour into your page. Um, so once we've accessed this page, what we need to do now is we need to grab the HTML code direct for your virtual tour. Um, so I'll show you how to do that now. So if you go to your tour, and the way to do so, if you don't know already, is to type in your business name. So here we have CSC the Gherkin, and type that into Google Maps. And just below there, you'll have a see inside box. Click on the see inside box, and it will load up your tour. Um, and then, as you see here, I'm inside the Gherkin. And what you need to do next is choose the look, uh, starting point, or the look of the tour as you want it to appear on your Facebook page. Um, it's the first thing people are going to see, so it's very important. And um, what I'm going to do is I'm going to choose I'm going to choose this point here, just because it gives you the view over London. Um, so now I've chosen my start point. What you'll then need to do is grab the HTML code, and the way to do that is to click on these three dots here. And if you click that, you'll see a drop down appear saying "Share or Embed Image." So you want to click that if you just go to embed image and you'll first need to just go onto the left hand side click the um, size drop down and go custom size the optimal size for the virtual tour on your Facebook page is 810 by 500 you'll then just need to copy the code below copy that um, and then go back to the uh, tab on your Facebook page so that you can then paste your code directly into here. Voila. Very important part, you just need to then save this as uh, so a save settings there. Um, and then next thing is to just go down these icons here and make a few more changes. Um, so what I'd recommend is if you go to tab settings um, and then just you can change the image here um, but you can also just change the tab name very quickly. So most popular uh, tab name is normally see inside or see inside with your business name so I'll put see inside CSC's the gherkin save settings and then if you go to share settings and you can choose all these different options here and I'll just click this one for now show share button at top of tab this basically gives uh, the user viewing your tour the opportunity to share your virtual tour onto their Facebook page obviously very good for engagement um, so we save settings again and that's it. So that will have your tour embedded into your Facebook page. So the next thing to do now is just uh, view the Facebook tab so you can view your tour on Facebook. And you can do that up the top left just here. So if I click on view Facebook tab and should load me directly into the Gherkin by the virtual tour. And it's my exact start point as well. And there you go. And then you can navigate your way around exactly as you do normally on Google. But as you can see, we're on Facebook.
and there you go. I um, hope you enjoyed this video. Um, we have many more videos, uh, one detailing how to embed the tour into your website, another detailing how to access direct links to your virtual tour. Please go to our YouTube page, like it, um, go to our Facebook page, like it. We're very, very, very um, happy to answer any questions you might have, so please do get in touch if you require any assistance. Um, and yeah, have a great day. Thank you.